Hulk, go easy on me. I'll turn over a new leaf, I swear. Just give me a chance. Well, this is new. Showing remorse, Eggman? If you played nice, I wouldn't have to break all your toys. Gotcha. What? <laughs> that was sealed within the planet has awakened. Now I just need to harness its power. Eggman Land will finally come to be! <laughs> You've really gone and done it this time, Eggman. Ah, Sonic, that's a good look for you. Festive. So long, friend. Huh? <laughs> Everybody, I'm Magic Mario TV, and welcome to Sonic Unleashed for Wii, or as we like to call it, Sonic Unleashed. And yes, I know if you hear something a little different than me, it's because I I have because I'm feeling a little sick. But you know what? We're gonna go through this. We're gonna give it our best shot because I have a save file for testing. But you know what? We're gonna choose Tails for this. Oh man. I am feeling real nasal. Okay, let's go ahead and start the game, and let's go ahead and see what's different. One big difference is that the cutscenes, specifically the pre-rendered cutscenes, and the in-game engine cutscenes are all compressed to crud. Oh great, I just remembered, this game has text. 
So I have to do voices, but I don't know if they're gonna be that good because of my stuffiness. I'll try my best to do that anyway. <laughs> don't eat me. I taste bad. You okay? Nothing broken? Oh, I'm just fine. Thanks for asking, Mr. Monster Guy. Mr. Monster Guy? Looks like things have gotten pretty ugly. Yeah, look at those teeth and those claws. What's your name, anyway? I'm Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. And you are? Hmm. Uh, huh? What is my name? Ah, I don't know. I can't remember. What? You forgot who you are? Yup. I remember something falling from the sky. <clears throat> and everything just going all white. And then nothing. I can't remember a thing past that. Uh-oh. Did I fall on him? Oh, man. What am I going to do? What can I do? Where do I go from here? What'll I... Ugh. I'm hungry. Hey, don't worry. I'll help you get your memory back. Really? Do you mean it? No. Absolutely. I'm sure we'll find somebody who knows you if we look around. Oh, thank you. You're the best, Mr. Monster Guy. I mean, Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, ten minutes already? Yeesh! Huh? You're blue and spiky. You're all different, Sonic. Sometimes you're scary, and sometimes you're spiky. How cool is that? All right, then. Let's go. This is going to be fun. Adventure, here we come. Let's try to remember actions as we search the town. Okay, I'll just try my best because I still found nasally as crud. And this is the version of the game I grew up with. Here and it's currently tied to GameCube settings. So that means it's the best way to play. Okay, I'm using an 8-bit controller because, one, it's like the best way to use them. It's the best way to play Nintendo games. And yes, I do have a physical copy of the Wii version of Sonic Unleashed. Sorry, I have a physical version of both the Xbox 360 version and Sonic Unleashed. I have, because Unleashed, I grew up on. Yeah, this was my bread and butter. Because I played this first, as I, grew, as I grew older, I really wanted the freaking Xbox 360 version. Because my first experience with Unleashed was at a sleepover. Oh, oh no, that was actually at a, at a demo showcasing that game. I think it was back in 2008? Back when the Xbox 360 was like really, really popular. Because one, it was like really popular. And I, and when I saw that game, like, God. The Xbox 360 version of the game looks so beautiful. I, I know how to play the game, dude. I'm just trying to get accustomed to these controls. And then Chip tells you what to do. And wow, I actually like the look of Chip in this. And yes, this version was also on PS2. But I'm using the Wii version because I feel like it's the better of the two D-Masters. It doesn't quite compare to the Xbox 360 version, but this one still has its own quirks. I mean, and one small thing, one one big difference, and one big difference is that... Okay, I, I know, let me freaking, let me freaking play the game, dude! I don't play the game! Just chip, just let me play the game! Okay. Okay, now we got moon medals. We got some other moon medals. One difference is that you get moon medals automatically based on rank rather than having to find them all over the place. Because in the action, because in the cop, because in the HD version, I know what I know what to do. Just let me slide. Let me slide through your DMs and slide through your DMs. Like, come on. Okay, here we go. Now we get to do dot on a dime and blah blah blah. L and R button. Blah blah blah. I said that this is the L and Z R. Nope. There we go, we just have to do that once, and now we get to speed run. Yes, continue playing. I'm just trying my best here, and... Here we go! <laughs> it's just a flop. 
Okay, you know what? We're gonna do that again. We're gonna do that again, bro. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do the thing again, and let's go ahead. Let's do it. Let's do it. Here we. We're gonna focus on day stuff. I know what to do, man. I've actually had this for my tenth birthday. Oh my god, brother! Stop blood! Stop mixing up your buttons! Oh my god, blood! Stop mixing up your buttons! Why is boost V is like hit one, two, three, bruh? Why are you like that? Blood! What are you doing? There we go. There we go. Oh my god! We got the S week! That's awesome! Wow! We got the S rank this early, like, god dang! Get S ranks to get all the medals. Because it's 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 kind of easy on the hedgehog stages, but the werehog stages, which are split into three or four segments, rather than having one long 30 plus minute segment rather in the Xbox 360 version, which is actually kind of awesome, it lessens werehog. It, it lessens the werehog stress, so we got another cutscene. What do you figure that was all about? The hair and those arms and and look at the chaos emeralds. So, is this what you usually look like? Yeah, this is the real me. Pretty cool, huh? Huh? Where'd you go? Looks good, don't it? Mm -hmm. That there chocolate chip cream sundae supreme is the pride of the city. <laughs> the whole world can come tumbling down, but they'll still light up for a taste. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey! What about your memories? Uh, chocolate chip sundae supreme. <laughs> you said it. Uh, Enjoy yeah, it, yeah. kiddo. Satisfaction yeah. guaranteed. If you don't love it, you get your money back. Hey! Oh, I love it. Mm -hmm. Wow, this chip whatever stuff is great. If you say so. How about you give me a hand and help look for somebody who knows you, Chip? Chip? Gotta call you something, don't I? What do you think? Yeah, Chip! Chip! I love it! Yum! Now what do you say we start asking around and see if anybody here knows you? Okay! Alright, and now we're heading into our overworld, which is... UNEXPLORABLE in this version, unfortunately! Uh, hello! Say, did you feel the tremor? Good thing my house is okay! Since the earthquake, the whole town has turned upside down. Hmm, do I know anything about you? Only that I've never seen you before? Sorry, all I know is that I don't know you. I can't help you, but... I bet the priest can. He knows everything. Though he has been preoccupied lately, something's on his mind. Maybe you could help him out too. Yeah, I just like the whole explorability of the open worlds in the Xbox 360 version. Now you just... You just text. It's, this is just text, bro. Never seen your mugs around here before. Are you travelers? Huh. Do I know this little fella? Nah, I can't say I do. Don't think we've met before. Me neither. I usually try with voices, but like... The nasal is getting to me. Huh. No one's around. Let's head back, Sonic. But it's nice to hear this freaking music, bro. It's absolutely incredible. Hello, good programs. What brings you here? What is that young gentleman scar that I am? I must admit, I do not. My thoughts are filled with the shrine. What is the shrine? It is a sacred place, famous among travelers. Since the Great Tremor, all manner of strange incidents have occurred. We have fewer tourists, and I fear our town may come to ruin. You have come all this way. May I direct you to our holy shrine? Yes, sure, which way? Yeah, this shrine is at the edge of town, blah, 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 blah. Go, can't go inside, but enjoy, which is stupid. Let's just go ahead and go to the sacred shrine. Is you gotta talk to old people to get to the sacred shrine. There's something I forgot to tell you. I came across this when I was walking, so I picked it up. It looks like some kind of metal with a symbol of a blazing sun on it. 
I really like it myself, but it might be a fuse, so I want you to have it. Okay, now we got the First Continent Sun tablet. For now, I think this episode's gonna be short. We're just gonna do this day stage and a couple of other material. Oh my god. Chip! This place is kind of spooky, huh, Sonic? If it was just me, I'd be too scared to go in. Blood. But you're a freaking god. Come on, dude. Oh, uh, X. No. Bro, don't mix up your buttons, bro. Why is blood mixing up your buttons? That's not fair. Let's just get in and we got a freaking... And this is like the only game that extensively allows you to listen to the freaking Gaia Temples. Rather than open worlds. Like, I like the Gaia Temples. Here we go. This is the stage I was testing. Let's go! And now we get to talk some more about the game. A big difference between this game is that it's it's relatively the same. It's it's like it's, pr it's practically the same gameplay wise, but content wise, it's really different. For example, the only level you get to play in Missouri is the boss level. An Empire City. Yep, say goodbye to that. We ain't having no Empire City in the Wii version. That's an Xbox 360 exclusive. As if you grew up on this one, you never knew the absolute pain of not being able to play Empire City. Or Missouri having actual levels other than the boss. It's like, dang, those look interesting. Bro. Let's go ahead and get some more things. Oh yeah, and the first act doesn't have the freaking intro music. I just try my best to survive here. All right, blood. Whoa, man, we got a really good rings. Oh, yeah, and the freaking boost here is in burst rather than one continual boost. Okay, the boost here in this game is a burst. Is in burst, so that's a bit unfortunate. I know, we're gonna defeat it in a minute. Like, yeesh. Yes, I know what to do, game. I grew up with this game. This was my bread and butter. Like, let's do this, bro. Okay. This is not gonna take too long, so, uh... This ain't gonna take too long. Or right, let's just come on. Blood, there you are. Blood, what are you doing? Blood just nudged me. <laughs> oh, man. Come on. Keep it together. All right, you can do this. You can do this. There we go. That's not too hard now, wasn't it? We're gonna try our best to save up our boost for the final stretch of this stage. Let's go ahead. Oh, let's go! This should have been one burst, but no, it has to be multiple small bursts because this game doesn't know how to burst! Here we go, we got the final stage! No. What am I talking about? Dude, we're only, we're only playing the beginning of the game, dude! The like, yeesh! Don't get yourself confused! What's with you? Okay, now we got three moon medals. Which means stage complete! That's actually really awesome that we don't have to collect to look for medals rather than having to get S ranks for the medals. I wish that that was uh, the feature in the Xbox 360 version of Unleashed, but I guess that's a trade off. I mean, it's not the worst thing I've ever experienced. Okay, now we get to do some bonus missions. Here we Which is quite awesome. Go! Bruh! What do you do? Bruh! What is with you? See? The Wii version can also be fun. See? The Wii version is also fun. It's not bad! Yeah, but then there's also the Java version that I have to play. Don't worry, I have an emulator for that. We got a tablet fragment adorned with a red jewel. Like, dang. A new mission for the guy son stuff? Oh, cutscenes again! Yay! Hmm. Still no luck finding anyone who knows me. Don't worry about it. Maybe your memory will come back on its own. Remember anything yet? Hmm. Nope. Oh, well. Oh. Sonic? Whoa. 
Mr. Monster Guy is back! Uh, uh, so when the sun goes down, I turn into this? Are you okay, Sonic? I'm fine. I just need to be careful who sees me like this. Sonic! Sonic, look! What is it? Oh, it's hopeless! The whole planet is split apart! We're doomed! Oh. Mister? Oh. Hey, mister! Hey, don't cry! Uh, ice cream! How about some more of this super tasty stuff? What good is ice cream at a time like this? Mm. Oh. Mm. Mm. The gum gum fruit! Sonic, your arm just stretched! Weird. Yoink! But it could be useful. Bruh. Oh. <laughs> There's no hope. There's no help in this man. There's no help in this man. But we're gonna have to end off this episode here, so uh thank you so much for watching this, the first episode of my Sonic Unleashed series, so if you liked it, <coughs> oh gosh! Come on, get it together. If you like this, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more Unleashed content. Because one, this is the version of the game I grew up with. Like, did I mention that already? Yes, I did. I mentioned that. So, yeah. I love you guys. May God be with you. Bye-bye. See you later. Next episode, we're going to tackle the night stages of Apato. So, yeah. Bye-bye. See you later. Peace.